Hello friends, welcome to the Mind Test Tech YouTube channel. My name is Prince and in this tutorial we will study about that how to print this type of pattern in the JavaScript friends. It is like a half time in pattern friends. So let us see the working of that. Before starting, I'm gonna tell you that if you didn't watch my previous video that is the basic of the patterns, then I recommend you please visit my that video so that you can understand this pattern easily in this video friends. So let us start friends. So first of all, what we need to do, we just need to print this type of pattern friends. So let us take first of all the from one to one to three, four, five friends. Then after that we will print that the lower side so first of all let's take the upper side that is the from 1 to 1 to 3 4 5 so to print that I have right here the program friends so here I need two variables friends that is the variable i and variable g friends and after that I have to use here the for loop friends after that I will tell you the working of that friends so let us see how so first of all I have to use here the for loop friends and in that for loop I have to initialize the value of i is equals to 1 friends and after that I have to use here the condition that is the i is less than equals to Five friends, and after that I have to use here the i plus plus that is the incrementation of the i friends, and after that I have to use here the inner for loop that is the inner for loop for loop, and here I have to use here the j value that is the one I have initialized the j value to one, and after that the condition is that is the j is less than equals to i, and then j plus plus, and in the inner for loop I have to use here the document dot write statement, and in that document dot write statement I have to print here the value of the j friends, and after that on the outer for loop you have to use here the, again the document dot write statement and in that document dot write statement I have to use here the break tag friends for the next line friends okay friends so friends I am telling you that if you didn't watch my previous video that is the first video that is the basic of the pattern then please watch that video so that you can understand this program very easily in this lecture friends okay now after that now control plus s friends now open that file from here double click on that now it is opening friends it is taking time now you can see here friends that is our half pattern has been printed friends that is from 1 to 1 to 3 4 5 friends let us see the sum of the working of that friends so first of all what we will do first of all we have initialized the value to 1 so now it will check the condition is i is less than or equals to 5 is 1 is less than or equals to 5 yes the condition is true if the condition is true then it will go to the inner for loop and here in the inner for loop it will find that the j value is 1 then it will again compare the condition that is j is less than or equals to i j value we have is 1 is 1 is less than or equals to one that is the i value we have one is one is less than equals to one yes the condition is true if the condition is true then it will print this statement that is the j value that is the j friends now it will print the value that is the one here friends and after that j plus plus we increment the value of j now the j value will be two is two is less than equals to one no condition is false if the condition is false then it will go to the break statement that is now it will insert the to the next line friends and then 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 this loop will continuously go like that and after that friends we have to use here again the again the for loops friends so i have to use here the for loop and here what do we have to do we just have to use here the i is equals to five minus one friends why have used here the i is equals to 5 minus 1 friends why 4 friends because friends we want here the value that is below of the 1 2 3 4 5 we want 1 2 3 4 only friends so we want 1 2 3 4 that's why i have to use here the value that is i is equals to 5 minus 1 that is the 4 friends if you use here the i is equals to 5 then it will also print the value that is the 1 2 3 4 5 below that friends but you want only 1 2 3 4 that's why we have to use here the 4 friends 4 or 5 minus 1 friends this is about that friends okay now what do you have to do we just have to use here the right here the condition that is the i is greater than is equals to one it is opposite in our previous for loop we have used here i is less than equals to five but here we have to use here the i is greater than equals to one and after that we have to use here the i minus minus that is the decrement operator here we have used plus plus increment operator and here we have used decrement operator why we have used in decrement operator here because we want the pattern in the decrement manner friend that's why we have to use here the decrement operator friends. Friend. okay friends after that we have to use here the inner for loop friends now the inner for loop the whole the program is same now we have to use here that j is equals to one and j is less than equals to i and j plus plus and after that i have to print here the j value that is the document dot write and here we have to use here the j value and after that friends after that on the outer for loop we have to use here again the document dot write statement friends document dot right and here i have to use here the br tag friends okay friends that's all here control plus s control plus r you can see here that our pattern has been successfully printed friends let us see some of the working of that friends so here friends 
our i value is 4 friends so it will check the condition is 4 is greater than equals to 1 yes the condition is true if the condition is true now it will go to the inner for loop and there it will find that the j value is 1 is 1 is less than equals to i value that is 4 is 1 is less than equals to 4 yes the condition is true if the condition is true then it will go to the next line that is the document dot write and it will print the value of j that is the 1 friends and after that j plus plus will increment the value of j now the j value will be 2 is 2 is less than equals to 4 yes the condition is true if the condition is true it will print the j value that is the 2 friends and after that j plus plus will again increment the value of j now it will be 3 is 3 is less than equals to uh, less than equals to 4 yes the condition is true if the condition is true then it will print the value of j that is the 3 now this loop will continuously go like that and it will print like that friends okay this is about that friends so this is the pattern of the half diamond friends i hope you have understood that if you have any doubt friends please comment me friends and if you like my video then you can subscribe my channel friends so thank you take care bye bye